Hey everybody, welcome back to the kitchen for another episode of What's Cooking with the Bear. It's that time of year, it's time for Thanksgiving. I'm going to show you all what I do for my personal Thanksgiving. Now I do go to other places, you know, on Thanksgiving itself, but for me personally, you know, here at the house, uh, I'll show you how I do mine, uh, at least the main course part of it, uh, but uh, I think you'll be surprised and hopefully you'll try it. So. Sit back, relax, and uh, we'll uh, get to cooking. All right, y'all. Here's what I have. This is what I use at home. This is a fully cooked, smoked turkey breast from Butterball. Uh, these things come from Walmart. They... Uh, it's the whole breast bone in. Uh, they do come frozen, so if you're going to do one, make sure you leave two or three days so you can leave it in the fridge to uh, uh, thaw out. But uh, it's really, really easy. Basically, you thaw it. You set your, uh, here's the instructions for it. Set your oven for 350, and you uh, put it in the oven. It says anywhere from a half hour to an hour and a half. I'm going to do it for an hour, and then we'll check out the thermometer. And if it's good, then we will uh, we'll eat. But uh, let me open this thing up here, and I'll show you what uh, what it looks like here. I'm gonna flip it over and get the bottom side. I guess I'll go aside first. Here. It help if I had a like sharp knife. All right, she's out of the bag. There's no giblets or anything, uh, but it is the whole. You guys can see it is the whole breast. All kinds of meat down in there, and everything. So. There's that. There's a little bit of water down in there. But even just like this, this thing smells delicious. So I'm going to get the oven warming up and we will uh, get this thing popped in and we'll bring it back as we're cooking it. All right, y'all. One thing I did forget to mention uh, in the instructions, it does say to coat it on the outside of the skin with a uh, vegetable oil. I did that. Uh, that's to crisp the skin up. So. Uh, I already did it. As you can see, it's shiny. So I'm um, wait for the still wait for the oven to warm up. Once it's warm, I'll throw it in, and we'll get to cooking. So y'all chill out for a second, and we'll be back. All right, y'all. Timer's gone off. Grab this thing out of here. Ooh, don't that thing look good? We're gonna check the temperature before we take it completely out of the oven. And uh, let me get you guys centered there. There you go. All right. Got my instant read thermometer. All right. We're still a little low on temperature. At least on the one side we are. It's about a hundred and four down through the thickest part. So we're gonna put this thing back in about another half hour, and we will uh, bring you all back when uh, after that half hour. So all right, y'all, we'll let this thing cook for about another half an hour. Now, now remember, we're just warming this thing up. It's fully cooked when you buy it, so. Oh yeah, she's good, she's good. She's perfect, so. All right, 
I'm gonna get it out of the oven, get it on top of the stove here, and we'll bring y'all back whenever we uh, get to that point there. Alright y'all, as you've seen, just took that out of the oven. So, sorry I bumped you. Got me a better knife this time. We're gonna carve into this sucker a little bit here. So, ooh, look at them juices running out of that. And that skin is good and crispy. I can see the moisture just coming out of that. Oh, that is awesome. Awesome. Good crispy skin. Oh, man. Look at that. Good and moist. All right. Let me grab a plate here. We'll get this plated up. We'll give you all a little taste test. All right, y'all. Pull this up out of here. I'm actually gonna flip it over there. Oh yeah. Now I'm just gonna take a little corner off of here. Something for a taste test. First, I'm gonna try that skin because it sounded delicious. Mmm. <laughs> you fight me for that. I mean, look at that. That is nice and moist. Very hot. Mm. That there will be the hit of Thanksgiving for you. Guaranteed. That is awesome. Oh, man. So, all right. Yeah, that is awesome. All right, y'all. There you have it. Smoked turkey best breast by Butterball. I buy them things. I'll buy them three or four at a time. I've got like four, four in the freezer up here. I've got two or three more down in the freezer in the basement. I make these things all year long. I love them. But they're only available around Thanksgiving time. So if you try one and you like it, stock up. They do keep in the freezer for about nine months or so. Like I said, I have them all year long. So this is good stuff right here. Mmm. So good. You almost thought of I forgot. Drink of the day. Right there. We got some Dean's eggnog. I usually don't jump jump holidays, but I like me some eggnog, so mm. sorry about that. Get it in my mustache. So alright. There y'all have it. Really hope you all enjoyed that. Really hope you're going to go out and try one of these. They are delicious. Now, I have put one in my grill, offset. Um, let the heat on one side, let this sit on the other. And you'll swear they did come right out of a smoker. Um, that charcoal flavor, you know, mixes with that smoke flavor that's already in there. Woo, nothing better than, you know, hot summer day. You want some good fresh turkey? That's it. And guaranteed, you make one of these up, it's the best turkey sandwiches you'll have for lunch next day, day after, day after, day after. If you don't eat all the first day. But anyways, hope you all enjoyed it. Hope you're going to try it. Please remember, like, comment, subscribe, share it out if you can. And uh, the uh, Sunday live streams, 7 p.m. Eastern Time, be there. We do a little bit of everything on there. So... As always, y'all, deeply appreciate it, and uh, bear appetit.